Hey, how's it going again? So we got the Rocky Mountain roast beef sandwich with pancetta, jalapeno Havarti, and a roasted garlic avocado mayo. This is the sandwich here. The Italiano garlic bread. Found this in the grocery store. I love it. Uh, didn't even know it existed. I use the bread all the time. I love the cut, the thickness of the bread. It's, it's great for everything. But I found the garlic bread and it's awesome and it just inspired me to put this sandwich together. This is an incredible sandwich and I can't wait to share it with you right now. So what I'm going to do, we've got about 12 different ingredients going into it. We've got the, uh, obviously the Italiano uh, garlic bread. We've got the, uh, the roast beef, which I sauteed lightly in a, in a barbecue sauce that I create myself. I make a nice, really spicy barbecue sauce. Um, I put a little tiny bit of butter in the frying pan. Uh, put the roast beef, shaved deli roast beef, fresh on top, and I, I, I drizzle it with the, uh, the barbecue sauce that I created. You can use whatever one you want. Uh, lightly sort of fry it up, um, saute it a little bit. It just brings out the juiciness of the roast beef. It's incredible. That's what we have here is the roast beef. We've got the jalapeno Havarti sliced and, and, and uh, sliced into two portions here, or actually four portions, but in half. Shredded lettuce. We've got red onion sliced. We've got some chives. Roasted red pepper, little banana peppers, great flavor. My own pickled garlic dill pickles, which are fantastic. We've got the pancetta that we lightly um, fried in the pan uh, so we can keep some consistency so it's not too dry and crisp. Beautiful sauteed mushrooms, lightly golden. We've got sauteed caramelized onions, really easy to do. And the mayo that I explained to you before. It's the, it's the roasted garlic avocado mayo with some Roma tomatoes. Horseradish and a little bit of Dijon. Real nice topper for this sandwich. What we're going to do is we're going to take the bread, the garlic bread right here. We're just going to open it up really quick. Just scissor it off and pull the garlic bread out. Stick this on the cutting board here. we toss this out. I'm going to cut the both ends off the garlic bread. Just to get rid of the, the hard stubble part here. We'll cut this in half because we're going to make the sandwich out of half of it, okay? So you're going to have half left over for whatever you want to do. We'll get rid of these. You're going to have the oven at 400. You're going to do about five to seven minutes just to get it nice and golden brown on the, on the end. So the deal is we're just going to open it up like that. I'm going to slice it just so we have a clean cut through it so I can make, build this sandwich properly. We're going to put these in the oven at 400 for five to seven minutes. Just like that. That's going to take no time at all. Wash our hands off. I'm going to put all the ingredients to the side so we can build a sandwich right here on the block so you can see exactly what's happening. I'll put the roast beef, the jalapeno Havarti, shredded lettuce on this side. I'll put the other condiments, red onion, roasted red peppers, pickles, banana peppers, sautéed onions, golden sautéed mushrooms, beautifully crisp pancetta and a little bit of chives and of course our roasted garlic avocado mayo you can't miss that just to the side and this is going to be our working surface check out the bread it's still cooking it's going to take a couple seconds to cook and that's fine and how we're going to do is we're going to build this sandwich quickly we're going to take the bottom out we're going to place it down we'll put some cheese on it put the roast beef the mayo and we'll work it like that I'm going to come back to you in one second 